what's up everybody? G here, VP of Content, FitnessReportment.com, here today for a review. Today we're looking at a pump product from a brand that we actually did an overview on. Uh, I'm talking about Vasomax from Performax Labs. Uh, this is a pump product from Performax, and uh, Performax, if you don't know them, they really know how to deliver when it comes to formulas and their effectiveness. Uh, not the flashiest marketing on the market, but they do know how to make a killer formula. So I'm not gonna waste your time. Let's get into the profile, taste, mixability, value, and let you know if we like it or not. Let's go. All right, so starting off with the profile, there are three separate blends in here, the pump and nitric oxide blend, the nootropic blend, and the absorption enhancement. Uh, we're starting off with the pump and nitric oxide one because that's what we're interested in here for the most part. First ingredient in here is five grams of glycerized. This is glycerol monosterate. This helps with cellular hydration, uh, muscular hydration. Uh, it's great for pumps. This is a very common ingredient in pump products. I usually see it about a gram to two grams. Uh, however, in here you have five grams of glycerized, which is a 65% standardization. There are a lot of products on the market that use maybe less than half of that for a standardization of glycerol. So that's great to see trademark from a glycerol, uh, glycerol monosterate at a high dosage. Five grams is a lot higher than what you're gonna see. So moving on, we have taurine at 2.5 grams. Taurine can help with blood flow as well as uh, preventing cramps. So uh, just like glycerized and taurine, hydration plays a huge role with pumps. So at 2.5 grams, this is dosed well. We like to see that around one to two grams, 2.5 grams ain't gonna hurt you and can certainly help you with not just uh, pumps, also endurance as well. So good job there. Next up, we have one of the sexier ingredients in here. I'm talking about Vaso 6 at 300 milligrams. Vaso 6 is an ingredient from Compound Solutions. And to keep it simple, it basically provides antioxidants that help with uh, increasing nitric oxide in the blood, as well as it also acts as a vasorelaxing. Who needs citrulline when you have stuff like Vaso 6 out there and glycerol monosterate for pumps? So at 300 milligrams, it is at the clinical dose. We'd like to see it in here. And it's since it's so small, we have no complaints. Moving on, the last ingredient in this blend is the S7 at 50 milligrams. Basically, to keep it simple, it provides antioxidants. There's not as many studies on it as, let's say, the Vaso 6 or the glycer size or the taurine even. So uh, we're not sold on it yet, but it's a nice addition. It doesn't really add to the cost uh, for the most part. And at 50 milligrams is at the clinical dose. They kind of prove that you don't need citrulline or arginine, whatever you want to call it. Uh, either way, we'll get into that in the effectiveness section of this review. Next up, we have the nootropic blend. Three simple ingredients. First ingredient in the nootropic blend is uh, alpha zone. This is alpha GPC. This is a choline source that actually has a high bioavailability. Bioavail Unlike choline by tartrate, this can actually cross the blood-brain barrier very well, and it has several studies showing that it works. We like to see this anywhere from 300 to 600 milligrams, preferably 600. Uh, here we have 300 milligrams, so good job there. Uh, it is paired with huperzine A at a 10 milligram, 1% standardization. Uh, huperzine, uh, prevents choline from being broken down in the brain. Too much of either or too much huperzine, too much choline at once can cause brain fog. So having lower doses of each may be beneficial if they, there might be some synergy there, might be a better approach to it. And we also have canna at 25 milligrams from canna ease. Canna is a natural, um, it's good for anxiety to put it simply. Get up with focus under stress and it's nice to see in here, not too many brands use it. Um, Performance Labs has no problem with it. So finally, we come to the last blend. It is basically just estrogen at 50 milligrams. Estrogen can help with the absorption of some ingredients. So overall, the profile is very good. They keep it very simple, uh, effective ingredients, uh, for the most part, not the same pathways. And really the impressive part of this is everything is dosed very well, especially in the pump uh, portion of this. They use Vaso 6, glycerized. I'm not afraid of trademarked ingredients. And they also, again, they don't need to use citrulline to prove a point here. All right, so moving on to the effectiveness. Honestly, uh, what more can you say? This simply works. It is not the most intense pump product on the market. With that said, it's still a very effective product. You do get an increase in focus and the pumps are still there. With that said, it is still a very effective product and the pumps are still there. They do, they can get painful. It's just not over the top of mind blowing pumps, but still somewhere around the 8.7 range out of out of 10 in terms of effectiveness. You're gonna notice the pump, you're gonna have a good workout, and it's a great add-on to many stim-based pre-workouts out there. So it works, it's solid, it does deliver, and it does need to use citrulline or nitrosogen or even nitrates for that matter. Okay, so now we get to the taste. Uh, we kind of went over this in the other video. We had the orange mango flavor, and it is very, it's a great flavor. It, it's true to the name, it is an orange mango, more of a mango flavor in my opinion. 
Uh, it's refreshing without being overly sweet, but it should satisfy anybody's sweet tooth if they really like sweeter products. But again, it is more on the refreshing side and it does certainly taste good. You're gonna enjoy this one. We enjoyed it. Performax, they do know how to flavor their products for the most part. Okay, so now we get into the mixability. Uh, with the five grams of glycerol monastery, you might notice a bit of a chalky texture. We had no real issues there. Uh, when you take glycerol monastery, you wanna hyperhydrate anyway, so you wanna mix it up with a lot of water, makes it more effective, and uh, you kinda of get rid of any chalky, potential chalkiness in there. But other than that, there's no clumps to speak of. It does mix very well, and yeah, overall, not too much to complain about, just some people might, may not appreciate the chalky texture in the drinks. We personally like it, or I like it myself. <laughs> so moving on, wow, what a great shaker cup. All right, moving on. Okay, so now we get to value. You can get this for about $40 off their website. That gives you 20 servings. Coupon code informant saves you 20% off, so you can get it for around $32. Uh, that's a solid deal for this. You can always add a caffeine source to it, and you'd have pretty much a complete pre-workout. You might not get your beta alanine or betaine, but those aren't always necessary for a pre-workout as it is. So at $2 per serving, it's actually dosed very competitively if you actually look at today's market. While we said it's not the most effective uh, pump product on the market, uh, it's still one of the more effective ones. So you are getting what you pay for and you can also get it cheaper as we stated. So uh, what else can we say? Performex Labs, really, uh, they knocked this one out of the park. Just like all their other products, they certainly delivered. They're not overly flashy but their profiles are always fun and they always certainly deliver. And even on taste, they delivered there as well. Some people have complained about that in the past, but they seem to really up their game. Orange Mango was great. Their Hypermax Extreme, uh, the pink Starburst flavor was great as well. So they really stepped up with this one and they kind of showed that you don't need citrulline to have an effective pump product. The value is solid, the taste is great, the mixability is fine, and you can't go wrong with this. Certainly a product uh, you know, worth trying out at least once in your life. You know, if, you, if you're interested in Performax apps, this may be a good one to start out with. And other than that, be sure to check out the written review for the details of the